How to add Twitter feed to your Shopify website. Now, this video is going to be a complete step-by-step -step tutorial. This will work on any theme, so if you follow along by the end of this video, you will be able to add a Twitter feed to your Shopify store. Okay, so to do this, the first thing that you want to do is, of course, open Shopify and enter into the, the latest or most updated version of your theme so that we can go ahead and start making changes. Now, as soon as that is open, you have the editor open. All you need to do is go to the first link in this video description, and that will take you over to this website called Elfsite. Now, Elfsite is the software that we are going to be using in order to get the Twitter feed onto your Shopify site. So the awesome thing about Elfsite is the fact that you can actually sign up for free. All you need to do is go here and enter in your email into this box. Click on start and then you will be able to go through and create a free account. Once you have signed up to Elfsite, you have your account. What we want to do is go up to widgets here at the top. And as you can see, it shows all of the widgets that are currently available on Elfsite. Now, going through these, you might notice a few that are cool that you, you might not have even thought of that you do want to add to your website. However, we are here specifically for the Twitter feed. So if you go ahead and type this in in the search bar, you can see that Twitter feed is going to pop up. So once that is done, just go ahead and click into Twitter. From here, we can then choose a template of how we want this to look. Do we want testimonials? Do we want a hashtag feed that seems like it's not working at the moment? Do we want a profile timeline? Basically, what do we want here? Now, as soon as you have chosen this, we can click continue with this template and then you can go ahead and connect to Twitter. So if I just go ahead and do this real quick, you can see that I'm currently connected. Once you have done that, keep in mind that connecting your account won't actually change the account that is shown here. You need to enter in the Twitter username, click on apply, and then it's going to change who shows up. Now, once you have the Twitter account that you would like to show up, all we need to do is click add to website right here. It's then going to save and give us like a, a quick preview of how this will look. Once again, if you're happy with this, just click on publish up here. And then it's going to ask you to select a plan. Now the plan that you choose depends on how many monthly views you get to your website. However, if you want to try this out or if you're new to Shopify, you can go ahead and go for the light version, which is what I'm going to do. From here, it's then going to give you this piece of code. Don't worry, we don't actually have to code or anything like that. It's literally just copy and paste. So we copy this code, go over to Shopify, and then from Shopify, make sure that you're not in the header or the footer section. Make sure that you're in template right here. Click on add section right here, and then we want to go ahead and add in custom liquid. Now, as you can see, for some reason, I have two right here. Let me just delete the first. So you can see we have this section that is custom liquid. Then all we have to do is paste in the code that we just copied into this box up here and give it a few seconds. Boom. Just like that, the Twitter feed is going to show up. And that is how you can add a Twitter feed to your Shopify website.